This old man, he made this. It's a short that can't be missed. With a knick-knack paddywhack, give John a bone. This old man came bowling home and sent to the home too. So this is the fifth of the Pixar shorts. And unfortunately, you'll never find it anywhere. You can only find the original version on this tape. Tiny Toy Stories. Ha ha ha. Good one. That's what the original one is at. The, D the DVD? New one. New re-release. And rebranded. The knickknacks on the table are very enjoyable. Sunny Florida is a flamingo. Look at the skeleton. Death Valley. <laughs> Surf Death Valley. <laughs> you know... The skeleton's little cousin is making it big in Mexico as a musician. Oh, the pyramid represents Egypt and the cactus represents Israel. I assume that's what it means. Ah, oh, this guy's a lot of fun. Palm Springs. We can make it more enjoyable. Give him a funny laugh. <laughs> and look at that tree. Sunny Jamaica, man. And of course, no knickknack would be complete without Sunny Miami. Miami. Yeah. <laughs> I start with this one. Sunny Miami. She's got beautiful charm. She's got a great smile, beautiful hair. She's got huge trucks of land. Yeah. And there's a major problem with this short. Is what they did to poor Sunny Miami and another woman you'll see later. Take a look at this clip carefully. Three clips, to be exact. See how they changed it in the 2003 re-release of the short. And since Disney owns Pixar now, I'm not surprised why they changed it. Oh, Disney, you're giving family entertainment a bad name. You're ruining the precious gifts of life. Why? Why? Oh, why? Oh, why can't Disney just let things be? Yeah, that's pretty much all I can say about her. And then we have the main character, a snowman. Oh, he's over there. A snowman in the hourglass. And he does not look too happy, believe me. The one thing about this short that I'm really nitpicky about, and this one pretty much got me peeped the most, as you can see, is the fact that they never released the original. No joke. In the first DVD of the Pixar shorts, they released a short that was re-released in 2003 and never released the original at all. Isn't that ridiculous? The original short that had all the great action and great timing. Pixar decided to pull off what Disney did with Song of the South and even the Fantasia Centaurs. Isn't that disturbing? They're whitewashing their own knick-knack cartoon. Why, Pixar? Why? You'll never know. Yes, indeed. 
you never know what to expect. Like a double audio recording. The, ne the next one is on the table here. Enjoy enjoyable. Sunny Sunny Florida, Florida is a flamingo. flamingo. Look at, look at the skeleton. skeleton. Death, Death Valley. Valley. <laughs> Surf, Surf Death Valley. Valley. <laughs> So as you can imagine with this cartoon, it's pretty much a Roadrunner Coyote Chuck Jones style cartoon. Snowman tries everything to get out of the snow globe, but everything he does, he fails. He tried everything. He tried a jackhammer, <laughs> explosives, he even tried hammering his own nose. You never thought you were going to see it this kind of way, did you? So the snowman almost about to give up, and then, touch, uh oh, there goes his dome, down he went, and he found something he never thought he sees, an emergency exit, under his house, the whole entire time. So as you would imagine, he got out, jumped out, and landed in the fishbowl below. Well, well, look at this. Goodbye, sunny Miami. Aloha, sunny Atlantis. And yes, she too suffered the same breast reduction as sunny Miami. Sadly. But wait a minute. Uh-oh, what's this coming down upon him? Just as I feared. The snowman is under house arrest for the rest of the cartoon. And that was Knick Knack, a Pixar short from 1989 and re-released 2003. Was it good? The original? Yes. The reboot? Oh no, re-release? No. But just for one minor change. I say if you're curious to find out about this short, then you may go ahead and watch it. Whichever version you prefer. If you want to see the original 1989 version, you go on ahead. If you prefer the 2003 re-release over that one, that's okay too. It's Disney. They will do anything to censor some original stuff in the original short. In the meantime though, what are your thoughts about this short? And which version do you prefer? I'm curious enough to hear about them and read about them in the comments below. Well, I gotta get back to rehearsal now. It's gonna be a big play performance tonight that I'm in. And I better get to it now. I'm Big Bad Ben. Thank you for watching. Thank you for listening. But before I go, I want to show you one more thing. I would like to show you what I got for Christmas. It's a book by Dr. Seuss. It's the 50th anniversary. 19 Seuss songs for beginners of the Cat in the Hat songbook. This is what I got for Christmas, and I am so blessed. Wait, wait a minute. Uh oh, there's no yellow in between the cat's arms. Oh, pardon me, there's a white spot. Error, 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 error.